What's up guys? Welcome back to the Strong Sisters YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm just gonna show you guys our chickens eating some food scraps. Gotta give the people what they want. But before getting into that, I wanna provide at least some educational content. So let's just briefly discuss chicken digestion. So a common question is, are there 100% grass-fed and finished chickens? No, unlike ruminants, so cows, sheep, and goats, chickens are monogastric animals. So they have a single stomach. So ruminants have a four-chamber stomach that helps them break down those tough cell walls in plants. And so ruminants are designed to only eat plants. Chickens, on the other hand, are omnivores. In fact, they are opportunistic omnivores, and it is very hard to find something that chickens will not eat. So do not buy vegetarian-fed chickens. They are meant to eat both plants and animals. So interestingly, chickens do not have teeth. They peck at their food with their beak, and they swallow food particles whole without any chewing. So their food then slides down the esophagus and into the crop, which moistens the food, and then it enters the gizzard for the actual mechanical breakdown and digestion. So the gizzard is surrounded by strong muscles, which contract and help break down the food. You also see chickens swallowing grit or small stones, which then go into the gizzard and help with the actual mechanical breakdown of the food particles. Then it goes through the liver, pancreas, intestines, and then finally through the anus with chicken poop, a wonderful fertilizer for the fields. So why is it important for chickens to be on pasture if they aren't 100% grass fed? Because they have access to a ton of food items that they don't have access to when in confinement, when producers reduce their food intake to a few simple ingredients like corn and soy. So the chickens are able to eat insects, bugs, forage, plants, and food scraps and so they're consuming a wider array of nutrients so as a result truly pasture raised chickens will have more nutritious eggs unfortunately the term pasture raised is commonly greenwashed and there isn't much regulation and so sometimes pasture raised eggs from the grocery store don't really mean too much your best bet is to find your local farmer at eatwild.com and ask him or her about their farming practices we're excited to be able to offer you all eggs here shortly all right, so let's get to watching the chickens eat food scraps. As a note, the high today is eight degrees Fahrenheit, so the chickens have no interest in walking out in the foot and a half of snow and getting their feet cold and wet. And so I'll be bringing them some food scraps in the coop. They prefer to stay in the coop right now to be blocked by the wind and to stay a little bit warmer. So let's see what's on their feast tonight. All right, on the menu today, we've got some apple and pear parts, so some cores, skin, and then some apple slices. We got some onion, a little bit of beef tongue, some beef suet, some wiggly beef bone broth, grapes, and then last but not least, some like pork crackling like things. I rendered some lard from some pork fat, and this was the stuff that came up at the top. So let's see how the chickens like it. chickens you guys ready for some food scraps anyone want some beef liver and kidney juice wine wine you like that oh dora likes that a little bit of the kidney membrane there she likes that liver and kidney wine yes girl it's five o'clock somewhere norma jean nope just dora get it girl Amelia, you want some? Yes, she does. Dora, you getting crunk today. Oh, Peggy, not sure. Dora, you finish it off for us, okay? So this is just the juices 
from the liver and kidney packages. Yes, girl. Come on, who's going to finish it off? Dora. Okay, Amelia Eggheart. <laughs> Megatron, you want some? Dora. A few last trips. There you go. Finish that up. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. All right, there you go. All right, first up, we've got these pork crackling like things. Someone is excited. You wanna come up here? All right, ready? Pour this. Right, next up we got some grapes. You guys ready for some grapes? Watch out. some chopped up grapes. You guys want some of these? Oh. 
All right, who wants to cleanse their palate with some bone broth? Ow, Dora, that's my finger. All right, who wants some bone broth? Right, anyone want some onions? Let's see if they like the onions. Onions? Onions? Back for the grapes. Onions are a no. All right, I have a feeling that the beef tongue is gonna go rather quickly. Who wants beef tongue? Peggy, you want some beef tongue? beef tongue. Oh, let me get that for you. There you go. All right, beef suet. Dora, do you want some beef to it? Oh, don't know what to do with it. Oh. Yum. And the fruits for one of their favorites. Thanks so much for tuning in guys. You can support our mission to make soil sex again and help us start our regenerative farm from scratch by supporting our GoFundMe campaign. Link to the GoFundMe in the description below. But until our next video, make sure you are behaving like a angel.